Corrosive or acidic water, as indicated by pH less than seven, is common in untreated water. For example, with rainwater, it's very common. This is not acid rain, but rather the rain naturally picks up some carbon dioxide as it passes through the atmosphere and creates a weak acid called carbonic acid. Low pH can occur in all tanks with the exception of concrete tanks, which can be alkaline, especially when new. Also common in bore water, and in some cases it can be very low. Bacteria can also cause low pH. This is especially common in tanks where there's a lot of sludge buildup. Severe corrosion is sometimes noticed by a blue stain. Now this blue stain is caused by your copper pipes dissolving in your water. You might see it in your sink, you might see it in your toilet, and it can even cause blue tints to light colored hair. And of course, if corrosion is advanced, it can result in holes in pipework and leaking. How corrosive a water is, is sometimes evaluated using a thing called a scale index. A scale index is influenced mainly by the alkalinity, which is the water's ability to neutralize acid, the calcium, and the pH. As alkalinity, calcium, or pH increases, the corrosion, according to the index, is reduced. Filtering your water through natural calcium carbonate increases all three of these components and dissolves only enough to neutralize acid and balance the water in a convenient, safe, and effective way. To find out more about neutralizing your water, please click on the links.